Well, hey folks, Species7 here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more Starbound, episode 2 to be exact. Now, I have been playing on another character just to try and get a little bit of a hang of the game so I wouldn't look, well, quite as daft as I truly am. Uh, this one named Jude, a human. So, uh, not bad, not bad. I'm progressing fairly well. Learning things, like don't build your camp the first place you set your but, um, anyway, let's jump into Dexter here. The cat character we have been playing. Uh-huh, 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 yeah. uh huh uh -huh. uh -huh. Okay. Sure. Later, dude. Alright, um, there's our pet slug. Why cats would have a slug as a pet, I don't. I don't. Oh, it wants some attention. There you are, sluggo. What the heck is that? Uh-oh. I think it's some kind of lantern, isn't it? Cool. Uh, I don't think we need much else here. Um, no, I think we've pretty much got everything. Yes. Let's, uh, hmm. What the heck have we got here? Ah, a primitive short spear and a boomerang. Alright, that'll work. What else? Oh, well, we got a gun. Why would I not use a gun instead of a primitive short spear? Uh, crit percent damage to... Uh, yeah. Why would I not? Uh, come on, think about it, dude. There you are. Up here, no, that's where I like my lights to be. So we're going to put a light there. And then our torches are going to go there. Okie dokie. Now, blocks. What have we got? Nine timbers. Dirt. Dirt will do. Mud will do even. Dirt. Okay. Well, I don't care. We just need dirt. And then I need food. Do I have food? I have corn. Hmm. Corn. Alright. Well, for the moment, we'll have to go with this. Alright. I feel like, uh, I feel like we're good. I didn't take my armor. Hmm. Well, that wasn't very smart of me. Before you leave the... Uh, oh, maybe this one isn't, because you don't go to the same institute. Alright, well, let's uh, do the thing, shall we? Planet Ho! Starbound. Information. Okay. Anyway, um, yeah. And we land right here beside uh, Uncle Bubba's factory plane thing. Alright, we've got our flashlight in hand. Well, that's not really what I want. Let's go with this. Thank you. Oh. Yeah. Let's go with this and this. What's that? There we are. And now we're up to our necks in it. Whoa! I didn't know that was going to be that deep. Alright, let's go back to this. Gives us at least a little bit of light. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
What is that boinging around in the water, man? That's worrisome. Oh, I see some more copper down there. Whoa. Get him, boomerang. Excellent. Yeah, where was that copper? There it is. Yeah. All right. Are you coming for me? What are you doing, man? No, you're gonna stay over there and behave yourself? Awesome. See, I'm looking for a couple of things. I'm looking for a campsite. I mean, Doc, whoever the heck his name is there, he's great and all. And in fact, what I'm going to do before we get too far away from him is, now that the sun's a boiling away, woohoo! Oh, he doesn't have one. Why did I think he had a campfire? Hmm. Huh. Well, the good thing is, we do. You've discovered fire! My data banks told me you were the 714 billionth person to do so. Well done. Practice katana, I've got that. Um, do we have some salve? I don't know that we do. I think we do, don't we? Our inventory. Hmm. Anyway, that's, uh, yeah, that's about all I need to uh, make out of here at the moment. Make sure we've got a bunch of timber. Perfect. Uh, I'll have some more torches as well, please. I forget that if you just click, click, click like I did, it doesn't actually work because stop is the second click. See, now this one goes so quick you can get away with it. Alright. Um, no, we don't need any healthism. But. Splish, yep. yep. splash, I was digging a bag. I was hoping I'd get like some meat or something, you know. But it doesn't appear to be the case. Alright. Let's go down again. Beep beep bop beep beep. Yeah, click 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 and Timbor! Oh, it fell in the water. I don't want wet wood. Good lord. And gotcha. Hup. Oh, well done. Leave it to you to fall in the hole. Hup. Okay. Hmm. Well, I could probably use some of this anyways. So let's grab some plant fiber. Yeah, he's coming, isn't he? Yep, he is. This one's so hard. Good heavens. Wow. Did not do so well there. Not so well indeed. Well, it's more like they're usually hard to kill. There we are. How are we doing food-wise? Not bad, eh? Not bad. Alright, let me take a little more food. Boom, chuckle, a boom. 
Whoopsies. There you go, Ladybug. Ah, always grab these. Because you get experience orbs. A lot of these little boogers around, I'll tell you. Oh. <laughs> That's not how you make a monkey happy. Feel bad for the monkey. Almost. Oh man, look at everything around here. Holy smokes, man. Nice thing with the boomerang is it'll actually fetch stuff back for you too. Take that. What do we got here? Okay. Alrighty. Oh, yes, please. I'll have some corn. Is that copper? Yes, it is. Look at that. Uh oh. Yes, ma'am. I'm getting there. Uh, one, two, three. It's on five.
holen. Interesting. It's the first time I've run into lead. Okay, we already got that corn. So, ooh, potato. We will be having that, thank you. A little bit of money. This is just a bonus finding all this. Things were looking pretty bleak there the little for the first part. It was nothing but hey, I want to kill you things everywhere. Okay. Ooh, oh. I think that might be rice. Outstanding. More rice. This is incredible. The issue I was having with my other uh, playthrough was that I just couldn't find food. It was crazy, man. A lot less enemies, a lot less food. Yet, to the best of my knowledge, there's really no way that you can yourself change those particular parameters, so... Ooh, and I believe this would be iron. What the heck we got going on down there, man? Hmm. Oh, this is the campsite. Awesome. Um. God, that's quite the drop. Am I even going to survive it? Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. Well, that's not a friendly. Well, thanks for uh, not being particularly helpful there, Ladybug. Let's see what he's got to say, shall we? Hey, stranger. If you're looking for core fragments, you might find a bunch down in this old mine. You should check it out. Well, that's exactly why we're here, of course. Um. Hmm. The other nice thing is there's a tent here where we can sleep. And, uh... Ah, I see. It's way down there. Okay. Cool. But first thing we're going to do here, actually... See what sort of stuff he's got. Oh yeah, we'll have all of it. Thanks, man. <laughs> Including a couple of core fragment. Oh, one core fragment. Very cool. All right, we've got a tent. We've got a dude. Corn. <gasps> yes. Thank you. Nothing in that one. Oh, more stuff. Manipulator. Oh, yeah, you can use those to upgrade your uh, molecular monkey wrench thing there. All right, now, food. Very, very important. Baked potatoes, yes, please. One. Two. Nice. Baked pearl peas, please. Some biled rice. Oh, nice. Ooh, 
look at that, four of them. And of course we have some popcorn. Hey, nice light snack. Oh, ah, yeah. And robo snacks, but I'm not a robo. Pop it like it's hot. Type herbivore. Well, we're omnivores, so we can eat what a carnivore eats. We can eat what a uh, herbivore eats. Isn't that cool? All right, man. So that's food. Um, yeah, I think the thing we need to do right now is that. Sleep until our health is back to maximizations. Because this is where we want to be. This is uh, going to be our new home. <clears throat> See, I'm just going to lay here when my health is hey, perfect. Let's have a look at our inventory. Just because we get so many things now. Alright, now I don't want to use these anymore. Um, so come out of there, please. I don't really want my guitar in there. That's pretty good, though, you know. That's their kind of homeworld weapon, eh? But what I do want in there is food. So we're gonna go with boiled apar rice and uh, some evaporated potatoes. Excellent. Alright. Right there. There. What other cool stuff did we get? What's this? A Graxus Skybonker. Ooh. Swift melee weapon will make them bleed. Ooh, it's a pretty darn good weapon, actually, for melee. Not bad at all. Um, there we go. What is this? Our cell phone, right? Eh, spear, don't care. Okay. Blocks. What we get? Oh, a little bit of cobblestone. Okay. There's our fire. Ooh, we have our inventor's table. A green dome tent. A barrel fire. It was a lava lamp that we took from the spaceship. Cool. Manipulator module. Lovely. Alright. Now. That we... Oh, I guess I can get up. <laughs> hey, dude. How you doing, man? Right on. Cool. Yeah. Alright, so what I want to do here actually is... Gather these up. And grab the seed for this. I think we're going to level this out a little bit. remove the background wall? I think just like Terraria, it's just right click with the same tool. And the same thing with placing walls. Something I hadn't actually realized until I looked it up. Okay. And... Alright, well he's in the other tent getting himself some Z's eyes, isn't he? So, that'll work. This should do for a start anyways. Alright, let's get uh, a little bit of light going on here, shall we? There we are. That's a little better. Alright, now we need lots and lots of timber. Timber, there we are, timber. Okay. And if we select four, we can start placing said timbers. That's not what I want to do, though. Um, I 
I'd like to know how you can put them down just in singles like that. That would be cool. Let's have a look though. Can I do anything with these timbers? Like, can I make actual like flooring and stuff? Really, I have to make a table for that, I think, don't I? Yeah. Alright. So. Four, actually. Ooh. corner of the tent's going to be in the way. No, already. Oops. <laughs> uh, yeah, I did really well there, didn't we? Come here, you. I wish I knew how to just place single columns like this, because I've seen it done. Um, does it show in controls? MM precision. I don't care about expressions. Perhaps. Oops, sorry, it's four, not five. Ah, it is, look at that. Very cool. Very cool indeed. I'm glad I figured that out. By looking at the directions, no less. Eh? <laughs> Who'd have thought? Who would have thought? Okay. I think I want that tent out of there. Pop. Whee! Okay. In fact... Now that I know how to do that... You get this little micro stutters once in a while. I don't know if it's maybe the game is saving the background or something. Okay. Oops, we're getting hungry, aren't we? Toxins from what? to all of this stuff. Oh! Uh-huh. Oh, it won't let me do anything while this is going on? How long does this thing take? Surely it wears off eventually. Okay. 
it's just getting just a little annoying. Wow, does that ever take a while? Planty stuff. Oh, right. It's a feline breed. I need to eat meat. I haven't found any yet. Other than those canned meat that we have. Oh, come on. Wow. Um, that should be done now. Is that just go on forever or what? Stop. Crap, that's annoying. Thank you, finally. Wow. Well, I gotta find something that's gonna give me meat, apparently. Alright, we're back at full health. Oy vey. either is it there we go push those out and then we're gonna be making a door here so there we go have a door yet, but uh, that's where it's going to go. <laughs> Alright, back to our timber laying skills. of my height. actually reach that point directly above my head. Well, that's not convenient. There we are. Huh. I guess we just got an extra one there. No biggie. Alright, now let's get this place down. Shall we? table. Boom. Now, from there, wooden workstation. What do I need? More timber. Okay, so we can certainly make timber. enough. Now, foraging table, wood. Uh-oh. Whew. Okay. 
Did we end up with that thing? Bo bo bo. No. I guess it didn't really have time to make it, did it? myself a door, man. Just a normal wooden door. Yes, there we go. Oh, why do we not have enough? More timber! There's a shocker. Oh, it's bigger than that, is it? Okay. Well, there's a shocker, too. <laughs> we need to take that off. Perfect. Now, Get our door going on. Excellent. Boom. Perfect. Now, let's make us some more timber, because, you know, that's what we do. Okay. Can you not open that door, dude? Is this going to be an issue for you? I could make a suggestion, like, stay the heck out then. All right. Oh, you did manage that, did you? Well, good for you. Excellent. There's a wooden door. And this side, of course, I didn't adjust. Oh, there's the rain. So we got that door here just in time, man. There we are. Our first, uh, more or less, structure. But, like I said, my issue here is what the heck am I gonna eat? Huh. Will you stop doing that, dude? What makes you think I want you going around letting all the rain into my house? Do it again. I said do it again. <laughs> Oh, he's gonna too. Yeah, you better close those behind you. Punk. Alright, I need something that's gonna give me food, man. You. No food? And I hate you. Oh, you look like food to me, man. Good at all. Well, guys, I think actually here I'm just noticing we're getting uh, 
quite carried away into the episode here. We're at like 40 plus minutes. So I think I'm going to call this one. And, uh, Next time around, I'll try and solve the mystery of what the heck I'm supposed to eat, and uh, we'll start exploring the cavern. Oh, well, whatever that thing is, it's pretty solid. Oh, another lead, I see. Is there more copper back here? No. Eh, not much going on here. Unfortunately. Oops. There we go. More experience. Yeah, that's going to become an issue. It is, it is, it is. But I think I'm going to end it there, guys. Next time around, like I said, we'll uh, see if we can't get some of that sorted out. And uh, hopefully go from there. But until then, take care of each other. Don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoy and you want to see more. And uh, it's been Species 7. Playing Starbound. Highly modified. Oh, there is a list of the mods in the description down below, by the way. Alright, take care of each other, folks. And ciao for now.